Russia's military says two U.S. fighter jets dropped phosphorus bombs over Syria's Deir al zawr province on Saturday. In a statement, Russian General Vladimir uh, Savchenko added that the airstrikes targeted military bases in civilian areas in the village of Hajim. Savchenko said the raid sparked huge fires. He noted that Russia is still verifying the information concerning possible deaths and injuries. Washington has denied any use of phosphorus bombs. The use of munitions containing phosphorus is prohibited according to an additional protocol to the Geneva Convention of 1949. However, human rights groups say the U.S.-led coalition has a number of times used phosphorus munitions over the course of the Syria conflict. Political commentator Paul Arruti says there's no international authority uh, with enforcement power to stop Washington from using phosphorus bombs. As to what use of uh, phosphorus bombs, they've been accused, they've generally denied it uh, in the past, but um, we know that the U.S. military creates these weapons uh, to be used, and uh, they provide them to other nations, especially Israel, for for that purpose, and uh, they're often used in situations which are forbidden by international law. There is no international authority that has enforcement powers without the voluntary accord of uh, especially the major powers um, uh, in the United Nations. So if the United States doesn't want to be investigated, it won't be investigated to a, to a large extent. I mean, uh, Syria might be able to ask uh, inspectors to come in from the United Nations, but uh, there's a very limited ability to enforce anything on what is, is still the most powerful nation on earth.